A rowdy crowd returned to L.A. City Hall demanding resignations of two council members. Pounding on the wood benches, waving banners, the crowd insisted that the council stop meeting until Kevin DeLeon and Gil Cedillo are ousted, the council president trying to maintain order. You've previously been warned about this. Clear the center aisle. Please take your seats so that we can proceed. It's been 17 days since a leaked audio tape revealed Council Members De Leon and Cedillo and former Council President Nuri Martinez in a racist conversation. Since then, outraged residents have stormed City Hall. I stand with these people that do see how serious that racism is, even in homelessness, even in decision making about land. These are policies. Today, the council did take action, unanimously voting to censure De Leon, Cedillo, and Martinez. The censure is just a way for the council to formally disapprove of De Leon and Cedillo, but it has no legal ramifications. Some might describe a censure as a symbolic vote. Uh, the symbolism here was exceptionally important in demonstrating that this council stands completely united. Still, De Leon is refusing to resign. Cedillo has not commented, and this could be why. As long as they're on the council, they continue to collect their nearly $219,000 annual compensation and other benefits, including a car, travel expenses, meals, and pension contributions. The LAPD eventually dispersed today's crowd, but they promised to be back at the next meeting, and the council promised to push ahead. Yeah, what a day in San Andreas. We know those protesters, they say they're going to continue staying outside of Kevin DeLeon's house. But for the council, they had that censure vote today. Is there anything else the council can do? Yeah, not only outside the councilman's house, they said they'll be back at the meeting tomorrow. There are some things they can do, but not much really, Pedro. Yesterday, the council did vote for a special election to fill Martinez's set seat. That would come as early as April. But De Leon and Cedillo, they're still hanging on. Uh, Cedillo is going to be gone soon because he did lose his re-election bid. De Leon could be ousted with a recall, but we all know here in California that is a long process. In the meantime, taxpayers are going to continue paying the salary.